What's up, Tigers? I'm Dr. B, and welcome back to Salem University's online orientation tutorials. In this video, we're going to show you how to access and attach assignments and discussions. Let's go to class. Okay, we are going to first navigate to Blackboard. So remember, it's SalemU.Blackboard.com. That's going to take you uh, to your login page. You're going to log in, and then you're here at your organization page. Uh, from here, you're going to navigate and find your course. <clears throat> Once you've found your course, um, you know, you're going to be here in the announcement section and we're going to uh, navigate first to our discussion board. And again, um, there's a couple different ways to find it. One is in this link in the left hand side. You can also look uh, in each week individually. Those discussion boards are going to be uh, linked there. So we'll find our uh, initial discussion um, for week one. And to simply uh, post, you're going to go ahead and create a thread. Uh, it'll give you the prompt that you are to follow. And simply you're going to type your response. Uh, my response for week one is as follows. And we're going to go ahead and type it right here into um, the text editor area. And it's got uh, different things. We can bold, we can change the font, uh, we can hyperlink things, we can add images. There's a lot of different things we can do here in the discussion response. Uh, as a reminder, remember our initial response should be posted by Wednesday of each week. Um, and that should uh, address the main thread of the discussion. Uh, so the prompt here by Wednesday. Uh, and then as well, we should post um, substantive responses. So more than just, hey, good job, but we should contribute to the discussion in our responses uh, to classmates and those should be posted by Sunday. So after we've typed in here we're simply going to hit submit uh, and that's going to submit uh, our post to the discussion board. Uh, now for our purposes here in this tutorial video um, we're not going to actually post in the discussion but you can see there uh, that it's very straightforward in how we do it. Uh, the second part is assignments um, and again each of your classes is going to have this assignments tab on the left hand side so you can always find your assignments by navigating here on the left. Um, also if you're in each week there will be an assignment link uh, in the week as well um, but you can always again find each assignment here in the assignments tab uh, and it's going to be listed with the the instructions as well as the information in terms of due dates and other things of that nature to access the assignment you're simply going to click the link uh, and again it's going to give you all the detailed information including how many points are, are available for it um, the instructions for the assignment uh, and any other information that you might need. Um, now, uh, in terms of the assignments, there are two ways to do this. The preferred method is for you to use your Salem University uh, Microsoft Office account that has access to Word, Publisher, PowerPoint, Excel, all of the Microsoft Office suites. You would create your assignment in, in that and save it to your computer. Uh, come in here to assignment uh, and let your uh, instructor know that um, this is my week one assignment attachment. And then you're just going to go in here to the attach files. You would browse your local files uh, and you know search your desktop for the file that you want. You can go ahead and uh, attach it and then submit it. And that's going to allow you uh, to submit your assignment to the Dropbox where your instructor will be able to uh, you know, review it and provide a grade. Now, sometimes you may not have access to Microsoft Word. Maybe you're traveling, maybe something happened with your computer, whatever. Uh, in a situation like that, you can simply come into this write submission box and write a text, type in text submission, um, you know, for your assignment. Now, we definitely encourage you to use your Microsoft account, but sometimes, you know, things happen. You might have to, you know, write your actual assignment into the text submission. So that's kind of like a backup uh, last case, but ideally you're going to browse and attach uh, your Word document. Um, once you're done there, you're going to go ahead and click Submit. That's going to submit your assignment to the Dropbox, uh, and then your instructor is going to be able to go in there and grade it for you. So again, essentially, those are the main ways to access and uh, submit assignments and discussions, either through the week uh, here in each week. So if we, again, if we look at week one, uh, we can see the discussion link here. We can go right to it, uh, and we also see our link for um, the week one assignment. 
uh, right here as well. We can click on it and navigate directly there. Or uh, again, the left-hand navigation, you'll see a link for both all the discussion boards and all the assignments. Uh, and essentially, that is how we navigate uh, and add discussions and assignments in Blackboard. And that's how we access and attach assignments and discussions in Blackboard, our online class platform. Be sure to check out the rest of our online orientation tutorials to ensure your success here at Salem University. Until next time, Tigers!